You can call me a feminist because I have never laughed when my teacher was talking about vagina in grade 8 as we both knew it was just a part of a human body as equal as eye, nose and legs. You can call me a feminist because I have never questioned you for wearing a tank top, neither claimed you for being sexually pleasing when you were roaming around being shirtless. But I am annoyed when my eyes and clothes are cruelly sending you messages I have never said. You can call me a feminist because it gets into my nerves when you are so interested to gaze into my price traps rather than listening to my wise words I am speaking through my mouth. You can call me a feminist because it bothers me a lot as you are being habitually on seeing the wholeness of a woman and their personalities. It makes me sad when you don't understand a woman can be both a great friend you can chill around having a beer and a girl you can introduce to your parents. You can call me a feminist because you feel okay to say what's between her legs more than it's okay to mention its inner workings. Apparently it is ungraceful for us to mention our period in public cause to act to express the actual mechanism of the biology is so unsocializing. You can call me a feminist without misinterpreting me as a male haters. I talk about equalities and understanding. So remember, in namesake of feminism, don't turn out to be a female lazy. After all, we are all human beings before generalizing us as male and female.